guys! Hello mga KLDR! What's up? This is Eliza and you're watching Benny and Eliza. I'm so happy to be back with another video and for today, I'm gonna do an unboxing video of Benny's package from South Korea. This is the first time he sent me a package mula nung naging LDR kami. And for those who are new to our channel or first time watching our videos, Benny and I have been in a long distance relationship since February 2019. But the last time he was here was December 2019. And then after that, because of the pandemic, we've never seen each other again. <laughs> Hanggang ngayon. So if you're a newcomer to our channel, please don't forget to subscribe, watch, and like our videos. We post videos about being in a long distance relationship and Filipino Korean relationships. Okay, so let's now see what's inside the box. Ang unang mabubunot ay. Okay, so he sent me a pack of Bibimyeon. Bibimyeon is one of my favorite instant noodles. This is cold, spicy cold noodles, Korean spicy cold noodles. Um, it's a bit unusual for Filipinos to eat cold noodles, but this is worth the try. It's a bit unusual at first, but I think you'll like it. So I was definitely looking forward to some instant noodles in this box. There are lots of instant noodles here. I think it's a given when someone sends a package. There are snacks and instant food inside. This is Dongji Nengmyeon. Dongchi ni mul nengmyeon. This is also cold noodles. I've tried eating the real one from Korean restaurants, but now because of the pandemic, I cannot go out to dine in. So this is really so thoughtful of him to send me these instant noodles. Moving forward to the next item is Korean bath towels because I really really like using these. It feels really clean after scrubbing, after taking a shower when we use this. After the first time I tried using this, my life totally changed. Kung gusto mong matanggal lahat yung mga kadumihan sa katawan, pati yung dumi ng pagkatao mo, kaya tanggalin ito. <laughs> so, oh, okay. So he got me this Himalaya Pink Salt Soap. Oh, let's see. Let's check how it smells like. Mm. Ooh, bango. Next up is Korean mask. KF94 masks. This is the masks we usually see idols and celebrities are wearing. And even before the pandemic, Koreans have been wearing masks already because of the micro dust. So, medyo hindi maganda yung air quality. So, they really have to use this one. And now we can see a lot of sellers of this in the Philippines. But it's much cheaper in Korea. Siyempre. Wow, there's so much snacks in here. Here's choco pie. But this one is in blossom, strawberry blossom flavor. Oh, maybe this one is a limited edition flavor. It says 2021 book. And a lot of regular choco pies. Yeah, the chocolate flavored ones. Sabi ni Benny, this, these are for my parents because my parents like eating sweets. Now, we have skin. This skin is skin gaba. Let's have this. Let's look at this huge one right here. Ba -ba -ba. 
it's a pet house. Next is Kim again. Seaweeds. And more seaweeds. Oh, these are like two different kinds. Uh, two different brands. We still have more here. Hmm? Baby clothes? Do it, no baby. Let's open to know what this one is. It's really cute. Ah. Okay, it's a doggy dress. Something like this. This is for Chloe. Chloe, meron kanta me. Another dress for Chloe. This is a handbook for dogs. The colors are really cute. Okay, let's have some more. Aha! 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 Benny sent these glitter name tags. Very cute. Cute name tag. I got three. My name, Benny's name, and CEO Eliza. Because I'm the boss. <laughs> Benny and Eliza, please subscribe to our channel. And oh, there's still one small item here. Um, this is the seal. They call it their seal, their official seal, or the stamp with their names. On it when they sign official documents they have to use this and like us in the Philippines we just put our signature but in Korea they have their official seal and this is used whenever they sign official papers do you know what this is this shirt belongs to Benny. He sent me a shirt with his smell on it. It may be weird for some of you guys, but um, mothers would usually do this when they leave their children so their children won't look for them because they'll feel like they're with their mom because of the smell. So the same purpose of him sending me this this is the first ever present I gave Benny. We were not yet a couple back then, but we were already like having meals together and it was his birthday. I didn't know it was his birthday. He just like roughly mentioned it and before he before his birthday, uh, he had to go back to Korea for some visa stuff and when he got back, I got this present and gave it to him and now he often wears it so there's a really uh, there this shirt is kind of special now sending gifts is just one way of showing our love and care for the people that we love the most but the key factors in a more successful relationship especially long distance relationship are of course communication followed by trust and the last would be respect. So I think these three are still um, the, the most important things on how you can make your relationship last. But I know that every person has a different love language. We all have different ways of showing our love and care for someone. So for some people, gift giving is their main love language. For some people, it may be spending time with their loved ones or service to their loved ones which makes it really difficult especially if you're in a long distance relationship i won't make this video any much longer thank you so much guys for spending time with me unboxing benny's package from korea if there are other kinds of videos you'd like us to upload please let us know in the comments section and we'll see you again next time
Bye-bye.